Hello you guys, this is Colatius and Latius, and for this video this is definitely a final part, but this video is a manga one, and it's um, two mangas only, so uh, I guess I'll start with Edo DK. I love LDK. So, I forgot, I, I know it means something, but man, I just don't remember, so... While looking through this, if I actually remember, it has some pretty crazy stuff in here. And so, uh, I think it involves him. He's really fucking weird. <laughs> he Or he looks really fucking weird. That was a cute scene. You saw that? It looked like he was hugging her, kissing her. Is that him wearing glasses? Wow. He actually wears glasses. Yeah. Uh, try to uh, uh. unbutton his shirt. Unbutton something. This part is like she's curious. I I could have sworn like when I was looking through it, like it would say Calvin Klein boxers. I don't think that's what it says. So she's trying to look, but uh, obviously he's away. He's like the entire body. Uh, well, obviously not. Oh, that's right, but uh, his fetish is seeing her in a panic. Wow. So, thankfully he's not that cruel, but... Uh, yeah, I guess you can still call him cruel. This one is mean because people can be complete assholes. Like, this bitch here, she untied her bikini top and they're ganging up on her now the bitch that her um that you know untied her top so it's like girls are just as evil as men they really are and you saw that example there that was embarrassing and why are you toying with my sister's body have you deflowered her sister's body I don't know who he's talking about, but I assume the main character has a s brother? I don't know. But, uh... This is cute. Got some words here. If I'm not mistaken, I believe that's the Yaki. Um, I think that's the Hiragana for Ya. And then I think this is key, and this, I don't know. Yaki something. So, we got a uh, translations. Oh, we got some more words. Can't tell what that word is. It's really hard because it's being blocked. But it could be the word for ta or a. Aiyaki. Takiyaki, you mean? Yeah, that would make sense because the kanji, the hiragana is like this for ta ki ya ki. It's gotta be takiyaki, right? Oh, god damn it. It's, you know, this is a great practice because I couldn't, I didn't read that. <laughs> I have a habit of not reading. Trust me, when I don't read, I can just like not uh, pay attention. And you just saw this example, so. Hmm, I've always wanted to try them. I wonder how they taste. Probably good because they're really popular in Japan, so, yeah. I remember, I think, uh, another manga that had takiyaki in it is, uh, I could be wrong, but maybe Skip Beat? I'm trying to think. Takiyaki, takiyaki. I think so. I'm not sure, so. Here we have a, uh, another one, Horo. Hori. I had thought it, I said Horo by mistake, but Hori Mia. Volume 3. Goodness, it's hard to actually say Hori. And it's Horo. <laughs> it says, The sweet ah, inspiring tale of school life continues. I know I did that up right this scene. Inspiring tale of school life continues. Dirty, dirty shots. I just made that up, but uh. I said delicious. By the way, they did this. I don't know if the other two volumes have this. I know, or I believe, uh, 
Oh, what's that name? Boku no something. It's like the author died. It's an, another Yen Press title. I think that one has it. I think Kore wa Zombie Desu has that too. I'm not sure. I have to look. So, I know Kore means this is a zombie. So, I love it when they use easy words like that. <laughs> so... It's pretty cool how mangas on the flaps, they actually have something like that and not just uh, leave it blank. And I don't know, Yen Press is unique like that because they put these, they're high quality. And, uh, oh, oh, I remember it now. It's called uh, Boku no Inu, I believe, which means I'm a dog. Or I assume that's what it's implying because Boku means I... Boku no, and I assume no, I don't know, I have to learn that, but, uh, I believe it is called Boku no Inu, Inu doggy, because I remember the main character, or the guy character is a dog, which, like I said, which sadly the author passed away, but that's not for this video, so, uh, Horomiya, a lot of other people are discoveries, because I saw another video, I believe it's called Fatal Foret, and he legit bought volume one and I, he did a review. I have not uh, seen it. So I'm pretty sure he gave it good remarks. I don't think he would just buy it. Especially, I don't think you would just dabble in random really $13 manga. Unless you know what it is. <laughs> well, I made no fucking sense there. It sounded gibberish. But I wanted to say... uh Again, you just don't want to not know what you're buying, and it's not it is expensive like that. So, what I was trying to say is like, um, this is a very popular manga. Oh, I think he reviewed it a little bit when he did his update on manga, and I think he said that he loved it. So, yes, it's really nice. It's a fresh intake. I think he said, yeah, he did. I think he said something about how the hearing, it's it's like you don't have those typical characters those like shy that character and this you actually have characters like this trying to find themselves i believe he said something like that so uh i don't know but other than that it's a pretty it's pretty popular well yeah i mean it it is damn popular even online it's amazing how they didn't pick this up earlier i'm trying to see when this was first released 2013 so I don't know yeah so this is what I was talking about I don't know if this is okay I think this is just a page of one of the mangas but regardless even though this is just a page I believe from one of the manga pages and not just original it's still pretty damn awesome just to see that actually that's really cool I really love it and I definitely recommend this manga even though even though I know I said when I first made the first volume that I actually did not like it online, but uh, I gave it, I still bought it <laughs> because uh, even though I didn't like it, it's always a good thing to also have a physical copy because I don't, I don't know, I'm weird like that. Uh, but yeah. So there you have it, guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. And I don't understand why they charge the 50 cents. Like, it's kind of unusual. They could have just said 16 or 15. <laughs> I don't know. So, yeah, there you have it, guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. And thank you for staying with me. I hope you had fun with the firstly made Dark Cry So uh, video. So, join it, and I'll see you later. I just. I feel stupid. I just said it two in the same time. So, Janet. Gosh, I still got to add. I'll still see you later. So, bye, you guys. Oh, shit. I almost dropped the phone. <laughs> Whoopsies.